In order to not miss important videos from us, subscribe to our channel and ring the notification bell to get notified for our latest uploads. Hello everyone. In today's episode we will show you the difference between Moderna and Pfizer vaccine. Amidst increasing unemployment rates, tumbling economies, and with food and nutrition security of millions of people under threat, the recent development in the COVID-19 vaccine clinical trials comes as a ray of hope. It's still early days, but the plans to begin large-scale production of promising vaccines and the continuous efforts of pharmaceutical companies around the world to develop a safe and effective vaccine against the COVID-19 brings glimmer of hope to the people around the world who have been waiting for months for a coronavirus vaccine. Currently, the U.S. government is banking on a handful of COVID-19 candidates, with Moderna and Pfizer being two of the leading candidates in the vaccine race. However, even if one or more safe COVID-19 vaccines under development are approved for use and distribution, their immediate availability in sufficient quantity to vaccinate such large population is highly unlikely. The outcome of the vaccine trials is being closely monitored across the world. Difference between Moderna and Pfizer vaccine Let's take a look how the two vaccines compare in terms of safety, efficacy, and distribution. Efficacy. Both the pharmaceutical companies Moderna and Pfizer use the same mRNA-based vaccines which are very different from conventional vaccines. In fact, the mRNA vaccines take a novel approach that has never been used for human clinical trials and they have advantages compared to other vaccine types such as safety, efficacy and production. While both the vaccine candidates have shown at least a 90% efficacy rate, Modern preliminary results suggested a relatively higher efficacy rate at 94.5%, a startling number compared to what other vaccine candidates claimed. Dose Both vaccine candidates use engineered RNA, a novel approach to vaccine development that involves injecting a patient with a part of the virus genetic code which then encodes the viral protein to invoke an immune response. It simply recognizes the disease-causing part of the virus by triggering an immune response producing powerful antibodies to neutralize the real threat. Both the vaccines require two doses. Pfizer booster shots are placed three weeks apart meaning if the first shot is on day one then the next shot is on day 22. Modern a second dose is placed four weeks after the first shot, which is an additional week. Storage Moderna claims a longer shelf life for its COVID-19 vaccine, suggesting that it can be stored at 2 to 8 degrees Celsius for up to a month and it remains stable at minus 20 degrees Celsius for up to six months. This makes the vaccine easy for distribution, especially to remote areas that do not have specialized freezers to store the vaccines. However, at the room temperature, the Pfizer vaccine can only be stored for up to five days and it needs to be kept at ultra-cold storage at about minus 70 degrees Celsius which makes it difficult for mass distribution because rural hospitals do not have such expensive and specialized refrigeration units to store the COVID-19 vaccine. Summary Both the pharmaceutical companies Moderna and Pfizer use the cutting-edge messenger RNA technology to develop their COVID-19 vaccines and it the only technology to be officially approved by the FDA for human clinical trials. Both the vaccines have shown promising results based on their ongoing vaccine clinical trials. But there are a number of caveats concerning the efficacy of their vaccines, such as age, demographics, gender, race, etc. The recent developments on the Moderna vaccine front suggest that the company may be on the verge of accomplishing something that would be considered no less than a breakthrough in medical history. But the question is which one of them will ultimately win the COVID-19 vaccine race. You have now learned the differences between Moderna and Pfizer vaccine. If you like this information and want to see more videos like this, Please share this video with the world and subscribe to our channel. Thank you for watching.